everybody, welcome to Imperial Lakes Online, a new online science series for adults hosted by Imperial College London. Each month across a full week, we'll be exploring a different theme with science and research engineers, which this month is staying connected. In this session, we're going to be taking a closer look at ideas of staying connected through drinks mixology. My name is Anna, I'm a mixologist and founder of Drinkbrite, an online platform dedicated to learning their alcohol drinks. You can check us out at the hashtags on your screen where you'll find plenty of ideas and inspiration to help you reimagine drinking. So, today we're going to be whipping up a simple cocktail with a dramatic transformation inspired by one of the best known branches of mathematics and science, chaos theory. And in the spirit of staying connected, I'm challenging you guys to create your own staying connected cocktails, which you can share via the hashtag Imperial Lakes or at Imperial Spark. So without further ado, we're going to get started on the drink. So today we are going to be making the butterfly effect exclusively for Imperial Lates. As you might have guessed, the drink is based on chaos theory, as we've already mentioned, and the effects of the butterfly effect. So that is the idea that a tiny change can lead to larger consequences within a system. So we're going to be exploring that through our drinks. And as we see within chaos theory, the idea that everything is connected, we're going to look at the way that the ingredients interact with each other and why those things are carefully connected within the construct of a drink to bring you something that comes together as a cocktail. Now, I am no scientist, but what I do have a reasonable education in is tequila. So today we are going to be using two different kinds of tequila. So we have an alcoholic standard gold tequila, and we're also going to be using a non-alcoholic tequila. The reason we're doing this is because of the theme around staying connected. So we wanted to explore the idea of staying connected when we imbibe. So that means bringing down the ABV a little bit. We're going to be using a 50-50 ratio of alcoholic and non-alcoholic. If you wanted to take out the alcoholic altogether, double up on your alcohol-free. You've got an entirely alcohol-free drink that's going to help you stay connected. Clearly, if you also wanted to up the alcoholic content, you're welcome to do that as well. So let's make a start on the drink. First of all, we're going to start out taking a lime wedge and we're going to just run around about half the glass. I prefer not to go all the way around in case uh, whoever you're serving it for doesn't like the salt rim on the glass. So we have some smoked salt here and we're just going to roll it gently in the smoked salt. I use smoked salt uh, not because I'm pretentious, just because it has uh, a smokier flavour. Um, it looks a little more elegant on the glass. Um, it's not going to be quite as overpowering as something like table salt. Um, maybe that is all pretentious. I don't know. Um, so <laughs> we've got our half rim here of the smoked sea salt. We're going to take now around four to six uh, wedges of lime, depending on how tight you like your drink. Scale it up or down. I've gone in with six. Got like quite a, quite a bit of drink. And we're going to take some lemongrass, which we have chopped. It's roughly about half a stick, and we're just going to pop it in the drink. And we're going to give that a good muddle. So that means just taking anything you have to hand, ideally a drink muddler. This is from a pestle and mortar. And we're going to just really extract all of the juice out of the fruit. And we're going to bruise and aim to break up the lemongrass also. Once you've done that, we're then going to add our ingredients. So we've got our gold tequila here. I'm going to take that and we're going to go in with 25 ml of the gold tequila. And we're also going to go in with 25 ml of the Mockingbird alcohol free. And that is the very simple base for our drink. So we've got the two different kinds of tequila in there. Uh, made obviously from the agave plant in South America and we've got the lime that's really going to cut through the kind of natural sweetness of the tequilas. So adding to that we have some crushed ice. The reason we're using crushed ice will become apparent at the end and we're going to fill it about halfway with the crushed ice and we're just going to combine all of those ingredients into the crushed ice like so. And then we are going to pack out the rest of the glass 
with our crushed ice. And you really want it to sit proudly of the drink, like this. Um, for our final ingredient, we have our triple sec. Now, triple sec is typically, tri triple sec or Pointreau is typically the final component of a classic margarita. It's an orange liqueur. Um, depending on which version you get, it's also a little bit lower ABV. If you're going with something like Pointreau, it's still going to be around 40%. So it is an orange liqueur, sometimes going to come in at slightly lower ABV than your full strength tequila. And um, we have infused this with our magic secret ingredient, which are the butterfly pea flowers. Now, these flowers are what is going to give us our transformation. They are native to the Asian continent. And the quality they have is they give out this lovely blue dye colour which you can just infuse straight into drinks. So we've infused it into our triple set today. You can infuse it into your spirits. You can even uh, make your ice with it, which is going to give you the blue ice. And all of that is going to lead to something quite special. So as the final part to our drink, we've packed out our ice. Oh, we're just going to actually pop our lemongrass garnish in, just ready for the final flourish. This is how you're going to serve it. You're doing parties, friends, family, loved ones, neighborhood cats, whoever you're having a party for. And we're just gonna pour over very slowly our triple sec infused with butterfly pea flowers until you reach the rim. And we're just gonna let that slowly pour down. And as it comes down the glass, what happens is when it hits the citrus that you've got in your base, and it's gonna to continue to bleed through the glass, it gives you this lovely deep purple colour and that's going to only intensify as the two things mix. Um, that is because of the way it reacts with the citrus. So obviously because of the inclusion of the lime and the lemongrass, that's going to happen. And what you end up with is quite an incredible blend from the blue at the top of the drink right down to a kind of purple and then ultimately clear drink at the bottom. And that is the butterfly effect. I hope you've enjoyed making your drinks with us today. Don't forget to share your creations, your staying connected cocktails at the hashtag Imperial Lates or at Imperial Spark. Go and enjoy the rest of the festival and hopefully we'll see you back again next month for another science cocktail.